Here we have the Bofang in the box that it came directly from Amazon. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Here's the manual. Looks like a pretty nice manual, glossy cover. And it looks easy to read. And we'll just set this aside for now and look at it later. Here's the battery and the radio. Let's pull that out and get a better look. See what else is in the box. And down below we see the normal accoutrements, the belt clip, there's the wrist strap, the ever popular ear adapter, the small little antenna, we'll replace that later, charger cable or wall wart, and a charger base. Pretty typical for the Beofang Pofung radios. Let's put this box aside and see if we can get a little bit closer look. So we have a base. That's pretty typical, like we said. Let's take a look at the antenna. Yep, pretty much looks like a typical antenna. Battery, typical Beofang battery. Here's the radio. Do you see something missing here? I didn't notice it first off, but you might have caught it. I'm going to zoom in here and let you get a little bit better look at the front panel here. There it is. Okay, so I wanted to put these side by side with the BF-F8HP, the other 8 watt Beofang that I've had for a while. And when doing some comparison here, they look very similar. Screen's a little bit different. Keypad's about the same. Bo buttons are in the about the same location. Uh-oh, look at that. It's missing a trim piece right there. Yep, it has one on the other side. Missing there directly from the factory because you saw it here first. Me unwrapping this thing. Well, so this one's got to go back to Amazon. Let's see if we can maybe get a new one from them that has all the pieces. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching.